this is known as a spinal tap. Correct. Okay. So a spinal tap is done. You said any baby who shows a blood culture should be getting Absolutely. a spinal tap. A positive blood culture is an indication okay. uh, to do a lumbar puncture. Now, in late onset sepsis, we also, part of the workup is to get a lumbar puncture. Mm -hmm. uh, and yes, just like you see uh, there in the graph, we uh, do it under sterile conditions so okay. that we don't introduce any infection into uh, the spinal fluid. Mm -hmm. uh, so um, we clean very well with betadine to not introduce any of the uh, bacteria from the skin into the spinal uh, fluid. But I have and to ask, I mean, it must be difficult to do this to a child, a newborn. Well, in a trained hand, it's, it's probably not, um, it, it's a pretty simple procedure. Okay. Because um, we're specialized in doing um, procedures on newborns, so uh, we have a very high success rate of getting those samples, and uh, we're trained to do it, so it's, okay. it's, it's not more difficult than adults, I would think, in a good trained hand. Okay. Now, do you position the baby a certain way to so, get So, I mean, there the are two ways to position the babies. You could either have the baby uh, sit up or have the baby on the side. I okay. personally prefer to have the babies on the side. And why is that? It's just a it's preference. It's just easier? Okay, yeah. just a preference, okay. Yeah, and um, <laughs> you're, uh, we just put the babies in the fetal position, so that mm -hmm. would open up the spaces between the um, spine uh, bones, mm -hmm. and then uh, we would feel for the space and introduce a needle uh, there and collect some of the spinal fluid. So, uh, okay, so now we've, now we've gotten the fluid, now we've done the spinal tap, what are you determining from what you put in the samples that you got? So the most important thing is to rule out uh, meningitis. Okay. So meningitis is uh, an inflammation of the meninges, which are mm -hmm. the membranes surrounding the brain. Uh, so uh, this is a very serious condition and right. it could lead to detrimental uh, uh, serious complications mm -hmm. uh, if it is present. So whenever we have a positive blood culture or a sick enough baby, we have to make sure that there is no meningitis. Um, so when we check the sample, we send it for different tests and we also send it for a culture. Okay. Uh, so if the culture, uh, and the baby is already on antibiotics. Okay. Um, if the culture is negative, then we know that there's no uh, meningitis.